Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Now I'm going to discuss the example for the absolute value inequalities. So determine the solution set of the inequalities where we have the modulus x minus 3 greater than equals to square root of 11 minus 5x. By referring to the definition of the modulus where we have modulus of x minus 3 actually equals to square root of x minus 3 square. So rewrite the situation where we have square root of x minus 3 square greater equals to third 11 minus 5x. Next my suggestion will be square both sides. So if we square both sides and we will have x minus 3 bracket square greater equals to 11 minus 5x. Expand the situation, then rearrange. So where we will have x square minus 6x plus 9 plus 5x minus 11 greater equals to 0. Simplify the situation, we will have x square minus with 6x plus with 5x and we will obtain negative x minus 2 greater or equals to 0. Factorize the situation and we will have x minus 2 multiplied with x plus 1 greater or equals to 0. Since this is a simplest form, so we are going to determine the sign where we have greater than 0 is a positive. Next, we need to split the situation and assume it is always positive. So x minus 2 greater equals to 0. x plus 1 greater equals to 0. So finally, x greater equals to 2. x greater equals to negative 1. Next, express the situation in a number line. Locate the value where we have negative 1 on the left and 2 on the right. Illustrate the situation where we have a dense circle towards the right, another dense circle towards the right. So since this is a positive number line, so the empty space will be a negative sign. So multiply the sign, so we will have negative, negative, so it's a positive. Next, we have negative, positive, and we will have negative. So finally, we have positive, positive. So we will have positive. By referring to the sign, the region will be a positive region. So meaning that here will be our answer. So finally, negative infinity until negative 1. Union from the 2 until positive infinity. Kindly take note the situation. Determine the solution set. So meaning that we have to express our answer in the solution set. So where we have this one is interval form. So the answer would be x such that x is less than equals to negative 1 or x is greater than equals to 2. For more information about this topic, kindly refer to the link at the description or you may click the link at the screen on the right hand side. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you think the video is useful, kindly consider to like, comment, share and subscribe.